I feel like shit and I look like shit, so everything is fine in the world again. Today we have a very simple plan, even simple enough that you could understand. We will be playing as one of the Hearts of Iron nations and one of my favorite nations. Yeah, okay, that was a lie. We're gonna be playing as the France. Special challenge, because I played the uh, no focus thing as Germany and somebody was like Everyone does it as Germany, so you should do it as France or the Soviet Union or the UK or um. And then I was like, okay, UK, you don't really get any modifiers So like you have less pop and you're a little bit weaker <laughs> But honestly the UK focus tree like it's nice to have you get war support and such you can mobilize quicker But honestly it doesn't really matter for the UK because your starting position is just so strong already with the US That one could be interesting because of Great Depression and Undisturbed isolationism. However, as soon as you get invaded you get home emergency defense act Which I think is in the propaganda efforts and then you just get uh, war econ for free 90% base war support you get you lose great depression Depression, so like yes, the US would just be slower. As for France and the Soviets, these two are probably actually interesting because these nations are in a spot where they need fixing. I mean, you can also do it as the Balkan nations, but like, I'd rather not. And Spain, like, I, I, I guess Spain can be interesting. No, don't make me do Spain. <laughs> Just, no. Please, please don't beat me again. Italy is just Germany in wars. Considering you're not gonna use your focus tree, I don't think it really will make a difference. Uh, this man will just keep on shooting every single person in Russia until you don't have any manpower anymore, so that's gonna be interesting. But today we are gonna go for the France. If we look at the French for... If you look at the French focus tree, I think that's gonna be the biggest problem, losing laissez-faire. Economy is just gonna be shit the entire game. First off, the very interesting thing that's gonna happen is we get PP, but um, we won't be getting Mustache Man PP, or we will be getting Asthma Man PP, because this turned it... Wait, it's only 80? 0.8? Yo, I thought it was one! Oh, US is one with the big sad. Oh, we actually get 0.2 PP. 1.2 PP without a focus. That's just gonna uh, yeah, let's let's just let's just go on. Basic research, Sith factories, and honestly, just give me guns and convoys. As they say in France. Don't really know how this is gonna work. Except for dying. And I mean at the end of the day I'm France. Like <laughs> this is just part of daily business. I'm gonna try and not make too many French jokes. Emphasis on try. Oh god we're not gonna. Okay we actually do have an army offense guy. Even though I mean. Hmm. Oh god of crappy guys. I guess we can go to war early, but that would kind of defeat the purpose of this challenge. Oh, early mob for free, thank you. We don't even need our focus tree to be strong. I guess we can dismantle the Maginot line as a piece of friendship. Um, no, I don't wanna give up 50 PP, thank you very much. PP is the only thing I have, mate. Oh God, we don't have any guys. Get the war industrialist going. And then just start spamming out mill factories. I mean, 78 factories is pretty good. It's not Germany levels or Italy levels. I mean, <laughs> it's not Germany levels. Oh, Anschluss just happened. Oh god, my heart just sank. But yeah, it's just... It's just... It's just Checo. I think. Ah, uh, those 10 should be able to hold the German border. Those 10 can go here. You might actually be able to hold here. The biggest problem is just gonna be we won't have any... My manpower because France because democratic because conscription. Oh the, 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 the Swiss factories will fuel our war machine. Yo, we actually get buffs. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna go for this one. All right We do need a uh, much more AA and The rest seems pretty decently balanced the rest. I think I'm just gonna bank PP now for the inevitable Oh god, it's 1939 August. I think shooting the army was a bit of a I want to call it a mistake But probably not the smartest thing I've done you five can just go here. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy We still have a bunch of green units here. Why am I not at war with Germany? That doesn't seem right I'm sorry Poland. I was not invited. I guess just build a wall. I think we should be able to hold with 
the goal and the Maginot. Whereas here we have the Orbs, we should be able to hold here. We don't really need three divisions here. Like if we invest more, we can push into Libya. If we don't, that's fine. Actually relatively okay with the spread. The research slot is the shining light. The beacon. I shall see what we can research. I guess improved infantry equipment too. Oh god. 50%. Yeah, I'm just... I'm never gonna switch my doctrine. There we go. I shift clicked that, that, that. We don't need seven divisions in this. I need to do this manually. But, like... Germany? Shouldn't you want to take out France? I feel like that is something that Hitler would have done. Can I join? Oh, yes, I can join the British. Just to make this interesting, I will join the war against the Germans and definitely not reload if this fails. Okay, we actually have supply problems up here, so that's a good sign. Let us join the war and probably immediately get crushed because the Germans. Strong genes. Oh, wait, no. <laughs> That's bad! But we're, we're at war with somebody who ravaged Europe! How did you... God, those stupid communists! <gasps> Support equipment! Yeah, I suppose we're holding. Very good sign. Ah! Red bubble. Ah! Oh no. Abort! Let's unjoin the war. Okay, okay, that's fine. That's fine. Just, just sack this one tile. It's very cringe to defend this, but let's just sack. Let's just sack. So, let's just destroy a few of those divisions. Get the manpower and the equipment back into divisions that actually matter. You are an idiot. I might just give up Lille. Honestly, losing this tile in Calais is so bad. Oh, we actually got divisions. There we go. Move. Whoosh -woo. We did it. Oh, no, 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 no. We did not make it. Oh, God, we're gonna lose Dunkirk. Where's the Brits? Defend Dunkirk. Oh, 7%. Oh, my God, that's a lot of red. That's red here. Uh, that's red here. Although, I think... I think Dunkirk is lost. Infantry expert, yes. <gasps> Infantry specialist! <laughs> That's even better than war economy. Like, genuinely, that thing is useful and... Yeah, just, just give up on Dunkirk. It's not worth it to spend that much on it. Although, yeah, I have a plan. 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 Fall back? Okay, we might be able to do this. Okay. That's good, I think. I think I'll also give up this one tile, just because it's- yeah, there we go. That's so much easier to defend. But hey, uh, we are making the axes pay for every single French droplet of blood. I mean, it was, a, it was just a matter of time with our stability at 38%, but like, it's just- Boys! Boys! If we work together, we could just fix this! We can survive! Total mob, women in the workforce, and propaganda heroes. There we go, we're not gonna get any PP at all anymore anytime soon. We will just have to make do with the manpower that we have right now. Wait a minute, I do have planes. I should have used those planes. I'm putting a lot of trust in the English. If their ships are not here, we are boned. Oh, actually, we can just change this later on. Hmm. Deploy. There we go, I wanted them to have a little bit of orc. Now we can just send them in there. Why are you losing? Oh, logistics wizard. Yes, queen. But I also wouldn't mind the four. Oh, but the infantry expert. Since we're gonna be fighting Germany for a little while, we don't have that many supply problems. So I think this is better. Getting the infantry guy. Oh my... F How much PP do I have to give you? <laughs> Stability was never an option. Do we still have an air force? Oh, yes, we do have planes. Uh, whoops. Still need support. Whoa, but we are low, running low on RT. I mean, we're running low on everything. Except for trucks, because we're not using trucks. <laughs> I'm very happy about those numbers. Yes! 30% factory output. Don't think it really matters at this point. We have minus 60% factory output right now. Thank fuck we have this poorest industry. Concentrated would have done the same, but still. We have 0% factory output. Modifiers. One division. Yes. Oh, I'm actually getting. I'm actually getting units from my allies. Okay. Uh, you just go on auto push for now. Up here is looking fine. Thankfully, we do have the British, so we don't need to worry about the channel. And time to produce more factories. And the AA is gonna do damage. Yes. That's one front line that we won't have to worry about anymore. Oh god, what just happened? What just happened? What just happened? I shall cheat, button. Attack! You're defending, you knob. Wait a minute. 
Wait a minute. Did it just hold on? Last sand costs 26.62 for free. We can last stand. Boom. This unit has last stand. We transfer everyone to this guy. Boom. These units have last stand and cost us free. <laughs> I think I just found something funny. That's gonna be very useful in late game. Like depending on who you play, you only have like 80 command power and then if you build chonkers, you can't even do force attack with them, but you could just send everyone away from this guy. Boom, force attack with this one unit, and then just give everyone back to this guy. Dead attacking, yes, 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 and counter attack. Not that they don't have any org anymore. Nine divisions from the UK as well. I mean, we have earned the additional units that our allies... <laughs> the second... The country with the second most kills to the Germans is Poland with 52k. First thing we're gonna do is prepare a naval invasion. Actually gonna reassign you. Boom, boom. And you know what? Just for good measure, send like three here. Gotta make this line defend more defensible. De defend the de better. Um, more radar. And uh, I guess more MILFs. One, two, three, nine. I need 11. Counting hard. Honestly, playing France like this might have been easier than playing historical France because you can just decide when you go to war with Germany. I knew it was gonna happen again, but First, I think we're gonna shoot a few people, some fascists and communists, and make propaganda heroes out of the rest. Oh, we can actually go. Let's hope for the best. <laughs> I just this game, man. It's Italy, Italy, <laughs> you are completely intentionally feeding. Italy is just inting so hard again. There we go. We've cut Italy. What? In God's name. Huh? How did you get here? El Generico really just fled South America and was like, yeah, okay, I'm gonna overtake the Netherlands now. Japan just, just now declared war on the Philippines and I'm taking out Italy and I've already had 4 million casualties to Germans. If the Germans go to Barbarossa, like, they will just fold instantly. Oh, thank you, I didn't have to spend 400 PP this time. Oh, come on, boys, 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 boys. We almost took out Italy. Don't just choke now. We got Italy, yes. Okay, so probably occupation also counts towards that. Uh, yeah, I mean, obviously. Obviously occupation also counts towards that. Are you a democratic puppet or are you... No, okay. They are... They, they, they are just a normal democratic puppet, like a UK puppet, not a peace deal puppet, because these peace deal puppets, they are awful. Yeah, just transfer the territory, I guess. So, Germany, your friend Italy is pretty much gone, and you lost 5 million. Do you want to fold, or are you still... Okay, somebody has plans. I don't think these plans are gonna work out for you, though. I have an inkling. Mutinies. I mean, that's one way to get over there. I'd rather you, you know, did this, I think. There we go, let's see if you can... Oh, we can't push at all. Oh, mutinies. Let's just make a small push, see where we land. Oh, 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 oh. Would you look at that? I think something interesting is gonna happen in Dunkirk. It is ironic that your last stand is in Dunkirk. I guess history just does rhyme. Oh god, where did my points go? Oh, Japan is coming in. Oh, I wish I could just get 50% stat, man. I have 90% base stability, man. And 43 is our actual stability. I feel scammed. How many flame tanks do we have? 7,000. You know what? Everybody gets one flame tank. Yes, I think you will be happy with that. Yes, thank you, India. Garrison support. 200,000 manpower. Yes. We are almost at 50% stability. We won't have stability problems anymore at soon any point. Soon ish. 45 Why? I don't accept that. I've killed 6 million Germans. I felt alone the entire game. I took out Germany. If I don't get like 80% of Europe, then I'll be upset. It's time for playlet peace conference until Hearts of Iron 5 comes out. And the Soviets have done nothing the entire game. Are you still scared? Surely you've. Wait, what? Why can I not see your focus? That's weird. Okay, I guess you have done Cult of Personality. Glitched UI. Something we've never seen before. A bug in Hearts of Iron. <gasps> we have 50% stability. Yes, we are celebrating this with improved worker conditions. Okay. I'm not gonna... Oh, fuck's sake. My neighbor has been drilling 
holes into his wall for the past six days. I don't get it. The thing that's confusing me is at some point you don't have a wall anymore. I really want a new apartment, man. Let's just build a naval base level four. Why did I say level four? Not a single number in a hot Safan four uses four. Apart from the title. Czechoslovakia's joint the allies. Yeah, I guess you never really were invited to the allies, were you? Oh, Taiwan. Um, right, let us move on to Taipei. Great, okay. I guess we've done pretty good. It's 1944. We have 340 factories, all of Germany, all of Italy. We've defeated Japan and we've also humiliated Japan. Where did you... Oh, you... <sighs> Now with his luscious hair. Oh right, uh, just show off that I haven't done a single focus. This was honestly much easier than expected. If you have a small grasp of, of Hearts of Iron, I think this is much easier than historical France because like I could have waited probably a year before Germany did anything and in that time we would have just gotten stronger and stronger. The only thing is of course you don't have unlimited manpower and you are democratic so like that's your one bottleneck, but I mean, you can just produce planes and tanks and all that to have insane divisions before Germany ever declares for you.